You were part of me for a long time. We've been together for so long, yeah, yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, like this video, and join the family. Let's get it, guys. So, it's good to see y'all again. Very, very good. I got exciting news to share with y'all today. So, today I'm going to be talking about how his second week went. Today is, today's Tuesday, so he's currently in week three right now, so, um, but today's video, I'm going to talk about how his second week went, which was last week. So, last week was the last week of yellow phase, and then just a lot of knowledge and classes and stuff like that. Um, I didn't get any phone calls, but however, guys... I got letters finally. I'm so happy I got these letters, guys. Y'all have no idea like how happy it made me, how motivating it made me. Like it put it gave me like a big high. Like I'm so happy. I had got four Thursday and I got two on Saturday. So um but he says that like you know he misses us and loves us you know he says basic is hard but he he's going to continue to push through cuz he wants this for our family um he said that he's got a, a very hard drill sergeant he said that it's crazy cuz um his drill sergeant is like kind of chubby but he be saying like the soldiers in his platoon is weak uh but he be falling out of PT so Ricky, you know, he's still, he's still funny, guys. He's still got that, you know, that humor. So, um, sorry. If y'all see me looking out, I'm waiting for my pizza, my wings. So, I'm going to be checking out my window until it comes. So, I'm hungry. But, uh, he basically said, uh, he missed doing laundry with me. He missed, like, doing things together. He said that he's got tested for COVID five times since he's been in training. Thankfully, like, thank you, God, like, he's tested negative every time. Um, he says he hasn't got any of my letters yet, but that was last week, so I'm pretty sure he's got a few of them so far because I know that they were holding them for two weeks because of COVID. So hopefully he started getting mine uh, within, like, the past three days. So I'm excited about that. Uh, what else did he say? He's just so cute, guys. He's just talking a lot about how he misses us and he can't wait to come home. He can't wait to hear from us. You know, you know, hear our voice. You know, just little sweet stuff. And saying he's excited for Christmas. He can't wait to come home for Christmas. He's so cute, guys. Look, he be drawing like little pictures on the sides. What else he drew? Um, oh, here's one. He drew like a little butterfly carrying a note <laughs> from basic. <laughs> He's so cute. Yeah, I miss him. But yeah, I've continued to write him every day, sometimes twice a day. You know, gotta do what you gotta do to help you, you know? And then my daughter, y'all know she's like almost 17 months and she's writing him too. Let me show y'all her letter she wrote today to him. Ain't that so cute and sweet? She loved drawing. I was just be like, here you go. Draw pic draw dad dad picture. And then she'll just get a pen and she'll just. So I'm excited because I know that this makes him smile too. Just because like uh, he knows that Alana did it. You know, he knows that she did it. You know, I don't know. I guess it's just like a uh, like a mental thing. So she's real sweet. She's been missing him. I can tell, of course, you know all that jazz but um so yeah i mean i didn't hear too too much from him besides those letters but he wasn't really saying like he did too much he said that he learned how to like stand at ease he learned how to march he learned how to stand at colors um he said he's been eating a lot of mres he said they had to throw his skittles away so he was really upset about that um he said he he sometimes writes letters at night um, when using his like little flashlight um but yeah hopefully this week they start posting like pictures of him um, I'm not able to share those on here because um 
confidentiality or whatever. So I can't share those, but um, if I see any on like a Facebook page, then I can share those to y'all. But none that they post on the basic website or basic training website. Um, I haven't got no calls. I hope to get a call, but I've heard that his drill sergeant uh, won't allow it. Like he's not letting them get a call to graduation. So I'm not, I'm not anticipating one, but I'm hoping for one. I really am hoping for good, a good one, not bad one. Like I hope. I hope, I pray every day that Ricky stays safe, he stays healthy, you know, he pushes through. But yeah, um, I miss him, guys. Of course, of course I miss him, you know. I have my days, like, days, like, I'll be so down in, in the dirt and I should be sad. But then other days, like, I'll be so happy, like, I'm, I'll be so motivated. Like, like, today, like, I feel really good today. Like, I'm so glad that I feel like this today. I didn't get any letters today. I was hoping for one, but it really didn't bother me that bad today. But I feel like if I don't get one tomorrow, I'm going to be really upset. So hopefully I get one tomorrow. I really want to just hear from him like every few days and like just know from him like how he's doing and what he's doing. And, you know, that reassurance that he misses us. Like I know he misses us, but it's him like physically saying it like in the letter that he misses us and loves us. Like I need that. I really do. But we've been doing good. Um... The kids are getting ready to start daycare soon because I go back to work in like a month and a half. So they're going to start daycare at the end of this month. It's going to be a lot easier on me. You know, I have more time during the day to relax and run errands if I need to. Like, I can't wait. Like, you know, it's, it's it hasn't really been like hard, hard for me to like, you know, do what I do and take care of them. Like, it's been pretty smooth this whole time. But... I feel like it's going to be such a relief when they once they start daycare and you know I have I'll have more time for myself more time to be able to do things that I enjoy because when I'm not taking care of them I'm getting rest when I can of course and then vice versa um but yeah so last week was last week of uh yellow phase it was week two he started red phase this week so this week he should be doing like the gas chamber the Victory Tower, the Confidence Course. I think they're going to do like a Rook March. Um, you know, stuff like that. But I'm going to keep you all updated. Like next week, I'm going to tell you all exactly what he did. I'm going to tell you if I've seen any pictures of him. Hopefully, they post some pictures on Facebook so I can uh, put them in the video for you all. Because I can't use the ones off the website. I really hate that. But got to follow rules. I don't want Gary Key in trouble. Especially since he's just starting off in basic... Um, Oh, another thing, Ricky did get paid on the first. I was so happy to be able to have that in our joint account. I was so thrilled. You know, it just kind of helped me a little bit more, um, relieved a little pressure off me because, you know, I've been holding it down for the longest while Ricky was a stay-at-home dad. And for him to be able to, like, for now, like, uh, what's it called? For now, for him to now putting in the pot or however you want to say it, like, it's good and I feel a little better because it's easier to do things now you know like we, we we make it of course but now that he's making money like it's we're like we're so much more straight we're so much more set like we never have to worry about anything you know we can really start um uh, getting our savings account where it needs to be so i'm really thrilled to see how our future is now since we're both working and bringing in income you know, very, very excited. So that's the plus, guys. Yay! You don't see my cat. Say hey, Cheddar. Cheddar, look. Look, Ched. Say hey. It's my cat, Ched, Ched. Um, but yeah, Lana and RJ's upstairs sleeping, taking a little nappy nap right now. Um, I'm probably going to be waking her up in a little bit to feed her once our pizza gets here. But uh, we're doing good, guys. I'm really I'm really proud of us, and I'm proud of Ricky. Like, he's doing the thing, y'all. He is doing the thing. He's, he's been gone. Like, he left the house, I think, like, 23 or 24 days ago. So, like, for him to go and do this without, without his family there and for me to do all this without him here, like... I'm so proud of the both of us. Like, we couldn't do it without each other, and we couldn't do it without God. So, I'm very proud of us. Um, he has 50 days left now. 
50 days, only 50 days. Like, uh, I just gotta keep riding him, guys. Keep riding him, stay motivated. Lean in my kids, lean in with some of my girlfriends that I met from uh, some groups off Facebook, you know, and hoping to see pictures. Like, honestly, these days are flying by. Like, it's crazy because me and my friend, we was talking. We're like, bro, the weekends usually fly by. Like, I'm excited. Like, it was a Friday. And she was saying, like, the weekends usually fly by. So, before you know it, you know, we're going to be in the next week. And I'm sitting here like, dang bro like tomorrow's wednesday like that's crazy like i feel like we were just talking about the weekend yesterday and here it is like Saturday, Monday, Tuesday, almost five days later like these weeks are flying by like i'm so grateful that they're flying by i really am like it's crazy like i feel like i'm just zooming through and i really hope it continues to be like that i just cannot wait for him to be able to graduate and i'm able to talk to him again like talk every day again like I'm so, so ready for that. Like, I will never take, you know, the time we had for granted ever again. That's one thing I've learned, you know, because I'm really, I'm a petty person. And when we, like, have our little arguments, like, I'm petty, you know, I'm I'm really, like, the type of person, like, I kind of just, you know, I'm petty, attitude. Um, I don't try to talk to him or something, but he'd be trying to talk to me and I'd be acting all kind of funny. So... This really opened my eyes and I want to be different. Like this is definitely a learning experience and it's made me a stronger person. I really want to change, you know, how I am and how I act because, you know, time ain't promised, you know. It definitely ain't like tomorrow's not promised and but definitely time's not promised because obviously he's gone and I wish I would give anything to be able to have him here, you know, and fix things like that i really do but i miss him guys but i'm doing okay i'm staying strong you know i'm doing the best i can like i'm proud of myself and i'm proud of ricky so Faith, when you watch this video i want you to know that i love you so much i'm so proud of you and i can't wait to see you again and hear your voice i love you keep pushing but thanks guys for watching the video i'm gonna go because my food's gonna be here <laughs> but yeah thank y'all so much I look forward to seeing y'all next video on when I post about week three. So make sure y'all stay tuned. Make sure you turn on your post notifications so you don't miss that video. So I love y'all so much. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe before you get off this video. But I'm finna go. Oh, they're here. So love y'all guys. Bye. Wanna thank you for watching. Next video we'll see you again. We trying to make it to the top, please. We wanna make sure you are.